Hi guys, yes, welcome like back to the Cairo Clips right. YouTube channel. <laughs> Today, we are back again with another great Cairo compilation video. If you are new to this channel, please click the subscribe and go. notification icons so that you are updated well, with our latest videos. If you want to check out any of the chiropractors on this video, the link to their channel will be in the description mm -hmm. box down below. Please leave a like on the video and comment down below like what you want to see next. So that's enough from me and I'll let the rest of the video there play you out. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me have this one too. There we go. <laughs> there you go. You good there? Mm -hmm. Throw this throw it as clear. Nope, slide your chest up higher. There you go. <gasps> Home run. <laughs> Mama, please. She's so funny. <laughs> like straight. Up like that. Slide forward. You ready? Mm -hmm. Are you sure? Are you positive? Mm -hmm. You want the self beach adjustment? Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> I love how you do it on purpose. You like talk and like you make me answer. I'm glad you can't see my face during this. What's that? Because, um, you know. Sorry. Sorry. Face me. Face me and hold it like this. Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. okay. Ah! <laughs> Open. Close. Ah. Jesus Christ. Open all the way. Open. Open, slowly start to close. There you go. It's okay. <laughs> so we're just on the outside. You okay? You good? Okay. It already started to move. Deep breath, blow it out. Numero tres, numero tres, numero tres. <laughs> Uno más. That's it. Yeah, it's tight. that it's tight. was freaking. Still not it. Oh. There you go. <laughs> Where are you guys going today? Um, are you leaving today? No. Early tomorrow. We're going to the beach. We don't know if we should go to Laguna or... Laguna. Down, A-S-I-N. Gotcha. That actually felt really good. <gasps> yeah. Bring your knees up a little bit. There you go. You good there? Mm-hmm. Bueno. <gasps> Perfecto. <laughs> that <can sound> nice. <laughs> Yeah, you feel that? Or that one more? <laughs> I'm holding you here, okay? There you go. Gotcha. Oh my Jesus Christ. Come up. That actually wasn't so bad. Was it? No. Weird. Get out. Gotcha. No. Stay there. Oh. I gotta do the rib now. Oh, freaking oh, oh, Jesus. Okay. Me llamo Rahim. Gracias. <laughs> <laughs> There's the rest. Oh my God. Te sientes mejor? Yes. Let's do the ankles.
that's called a home run. Oh, cricket, baseball. Soc- baseball? No. Really? Yeah, baseball is big, soccer is Okay, soccer. so you know the home run then. Yeah. Yeah, cool. Definitely. <laughs> Mama? People are going to think you're killing me because of her. Posterior tip. <laughs> Actually, this one doesn't feel bad at all. Yeah. Relax, don't help me. Alright, let that head drop. There you go. First ribs, turn your head that way for me. And here, reach this arm around, grab my opposite shoulder. Relax this back. There you go. So, little known fact about Morgan, black belt in MMA. Reach his head that way. Hold back over. She moved already, but see there's already a little bit there, but we're just gonna come in here. That one right there. Perfect. On your back for me. Next hips, relax your legs for me. Good, and we got a little bonus ankle out of that midfoot. So we're gonna lock out this midfoot here. Get a little mobilization there. We'll talus. Good. Calcaneus. Proximal tib fib head. Good. Medial knee. Good. Other side. Also, let me know what you guys think about <laughs> mix, mix matched socks in the comments below. Personally, they drive me nuts. Why do you think I'm just waiting? Morgan's gonna be a troublemaker. You already feel it. Proximal tip bib head. Good. Just a little medial knee. This one I learned from Howard Fiddler, and so it's just a neat little mobilization of that knee. Good. That's weird. Yeah, very weird, right? So we're gonna do thoraco lumbar junction. Take a breath in for me. And out. Lift your head, please. Perfect. And then our upper back as well. T4, let your shoulders relax the floor. Good. Let your head fall into my hand. Good. This way. Let your head fall into my hand. Good. Slightly open your mouth. Good. Same thing here. Show you how he's feeling afterwards. There you go. Oh, yeah. Well, that's a home run. <laughs> People in the building probably think that's a big old thunder boomer. There we go. <laughs> Yo, old boy. Good job. Still got one more right there. Okay. Slide so this way just a bit. There you go. <laughs> there, good. Okay, let's <laughs> turn you on your back now, please. <laughs> Corner, you say maybe. Okay, relax this. There you go. You feel that from your knee all the way up to your lower back? Oh yeah. Okay. Let me have this leg limp too. Yes, sir. Oh. <laughs> Let it go. Expected. Well, it was a while since our last adjustment. Yeah, we had, I mean, we did the one last week. Well, we could go. Good. And then before then, it was probably nice. like last year. Okay, deep breath. Really sit down. Nice to just get tuned up and feeling better. Yeah. Right Yeah. 
Well, tell them that at the beginning. Yeah. I think, you know, uh, when the providers, we're doing our job, you're less engaged, maybe checking in with us and once in a while with them. Right. But when the case is closed, that's when you start engaging with them more. Yeah. Good. I'm gonna Closer to me. Perfect. <laughs> and I know you felt that quite a bit. And now we're going to have you flip to the other side. Okay. So a little bit tighter <laughs> with this side, but let's go ahead and I want to recheck that leg length now. Let's bring this head piece down so you can lay face down the, the table. So what's happening, as you can tell, is she's basically getting strapped into this decompression. Now the reason that I really wanted to show this today was a lot of patients ask me about an inversion table. And when people bring up an inversion table, a lot of the times it's that old school inversion table that hooks in on the ankles and flips you upside down. Not bad, but let me show you guys this table and the reason on why this one is actually better. Now that she's all ready, she's all strapped in, nice and tight, we are going to lift the table on up. And as you can tell, the table is coming up quite a bit here and it'll come up. So what's gonna be happening is as the table comes up, we're now getting that lumbar decompression you know, my cord's wrapping across your forehead. We're getting that lumbar decompression. So we bring her up just like this. Now, typically how we would start this off is in the beginning, I'm sorry, in the beginning, um, she would be on for a shorter amount of time, starting off four minutes and then gradually moving up to seven and then 10. And then from there, so we'd keep her for 10 minutes in this position. Now, what are you noticing when you're like this? Do you I can feel like my lower back kind of pulling like this kind of pulling apart mm -hmm. okay so the reason that this is very well is this is holding you in from the hips here and now what's happening is obviously the force of gravity is pulling the rest of your body down while you're being held in from here so a lot of times you get patients that you know that have asked me you know what are my thoughts and feelings of a um, that inversion table this is the type of inversion table that people should be on just because this is actually holding you in from the hips and not holding you in at the ankles because the ones that hold you in from the ankles, you're going to feel a lot of uh, pulling, you know, at your joints in your knees, you know, in the femur, you know, in these joints. So you're not going to get as much of a, of, of a feeling or a pulling in that low back spot. We're going to wrap this around her skull and her mandible. Take a deep breath through your nose, Catherine, and relax it out and relax. Oh, yeah. Oh, my Lord. Yep. Woo! This is basically our biggest <laughs> shock and awe adjustment that we do, oh, but man. it works, and she's still kicking. <laughs> okay, let it go in my hand. Good. Yes, ma'am. Crack addicts are going to love you. Wow. That's a good one. That's a good one. Thigh joint on the left here first. And then the right one. L5, S1. Junction, I'm actually on the C from right to L1. Okay, let me help you up. Let's face 
Password Joseph. Yes, perfect. <laughs> back. Um, not the worst I've ever seen, but you can actually see the deviation from norm, and I think that's contributing to his poor posture. So he mentioned that he doesn't think the accident had anything to do with it because it was not exactly the same time, but I think it's contributed to it. Okay, so you ready to get treated? Yep. Good, take a look at those guys. Good. 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 Oh, he's a little sweaty again. <laughs> Come down a little closer. I want you guys to hear this. His neck is like good, nice. Okay. <laughs> and he smells like that every single time, <laughs> by the way. <laughs> As you blow it out, all the way down. Let your sh shoulders relax. Good. Breath in. Lean back as you blow it out. Breathe. Okay, this is how we do not like to give up control. <laughs> no, I don't. Okay, just kind of let your shoulders relax here. Turn your head so your face is straight that way. Okay, so you good. And then we're going to bring this down just like this and take a nice deep breath in and out. Good, and just like let it all go here. We'll give this a little push. Lay in your back. Okay, nice and gentle here. We're going to bring your hips down and give your lumbar an adjustment. Good, lay on your back. Good, and Okay, let your head drop in, just kind of sink. Let it go, let your hips go, let your feet go. Let your whole body kind of just sinking into the table. Good breath. That's perfect. Very flexible hand. There it is. Look up. Gotcha. <laughs> a little crunchy. I don't like crunchy crunch. I want clunky clunk. I'm still setting it as a PRS. I'm gonna do it as a spinous pull move. Look up at him. That's the <laughs> one. PRS, two, three, four, six. Oh my God. Good stuff. You good? <laughs> I feel broken. What's that? I feel broken. I just fixed you. What are you talking about? I just glued you back together. We're going to do the sail. And while you're doing that, I'm just going to apply pressure, okay? Good. Deep breath in. Blow it all the way out. Good. Deep breath in. All the way out. Deep breath in. There it is. Good. Oh my god. That was a <laughs> So if you want to come in a little bit, and then so we're gonna do the adjustment right through here. Good. It's really good movement through here. We're gonna do the other side too, a little bit lower. 
Got a lot of movement there. And then I'm gonna drop down into the thoracic spine through here. Good? Okay. Alrighty, so from here, we're gonna go ahead. Bend that leg, just like that. There we go. I'm gonna flip to the other side. Bend that leg. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Bring it back, squeeze your elbows together. Oh. <laughs> there we go, that was right through there. Tension, especially in the in that cervical and that neck area. Oh. Get a little movement in that shoulder. And then I'm gonna switch rotating to the other side. How's that feel when I do that? Yeah. Yep. It's not like a popping, cracking adjustment, anything like that. It's just getting some movement into that area. It's like that. Now when I bring it towards me, is there any pain with that? Mm -hmm. No, okay. So then one last adjustment that I do with the shoulder, I bring in towards my chest and... The Anthony's not a short man. Deep breath for me. Oh yeah. So we really got some good movements right after the machine. But now he comes every couple months, it gets harder and harder for him. Deep breath. Oh yeah. One more. Mutation? Um, no, I didn't get to see her video. Um. Just a bunch of different ones? Yes. Yeah. Okay, keep your teeth together. Just breathe through your nose. Just like that. Perfect. Felt that all the way down, didn't you? Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I got you. Boy, that's the crack eggs gonna love you. <laughs> there you go, good. Didn't get much better now. Oh yeah. That was smooth. Her lumbar spine, straight P to A on the z-axis lower thoracics mid thoracics okay there we go okay you don't feel your head pop lighter than the last couple pushes we had in here so light this up for you there you got your july 4 shirt on huh red white and blue <laughs> It's the shirt from um, Puerto Rico. Oh, it is? Mm -hmm. Well, they're American too, aren't they? Yeah. There you go. Good. Okay. Now yeah, let's sit you up and face that away this afternoon. So I got to talk and almost forgot that. There you go. Feel those all the way up? Uh huh. Excellent. Good. Okay. Oh, you're fine. Okay, nice and easy. Yes, ma'am. See, I did that smooth as hell for yes. you. Yes. Good job. And you're still kicking. Good. <laughs> there we go. Drop this in my hand. You have to show Craig this. There you go. Good. And Evie. Yeah, she had surgery on her shoulder. She so did? She's out a little bit. We oh. the right hand side joint and then the sacrum straight superior to inferior on the y-axis okay yes ma'am car are gonna love you too there we go there you go that's it Good, okay, slide down about half an inch. 
in. Let's put your arm straight out to the sides, palms facing up. I'm adjusting her acromioclavicular joints now. The clavicle where it attaches to the sternum, otherwise known as the sternoclavicular joint, and the costosternal joints where the ribs attach to the sternum in the front as well. Okay, and relax. And let me have this leg. There you go. Should have felt that all the way up. Oh, I did. Felt oh, good. Yeah. This is really decompressing the lumbosacral spine, the knee, and the hip joint from the bottom end. Okay, let's sit you up face that way. There we Sorry. go. Good girl. No, you're fine. There you go. Super. Do you find that your lifting has improved since you've been under chiropractic care here? Yes, tremendously.